Taylor Swift was performing my thrice daily ritual of perusing iTunes when a piece of art caught my eye. It was a Polaroid photo of a girl that brought me right back to the 1980s coincidentally. It was the cover art for Taylor Swift's new album, 1989, which launches at the end of this month. Now, I am no Taylor Swift groupie. In fact I can tee, off the top of my head, name one of her many hits, that have inspired some 80 million downloads. And even if you played a few for me, I am pretty positive I couldn't de-identify her signature sound. Maybe that says more about how unhip I am when it comes to pop music, but stay with me, please. I learned a lot from Tay Tay? And you can too. Because, pop deafness aside, I suddenly have Taylor Swift on the brain. From one piece of art on iTunes? Oh, that is but one piece of an impressive marketing mosaic. You see, Taylor Swift has been launching this new product through a variety of platforms over the last few months. And her dexterity with the marketing maze of today is only rivaled by her facile way with words and chords. Taylor is not only a music prodigy. She seems to be a marketing one as well.